hi everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is patience so today we are going to be making this beautiful and very easy tool skirt with an elastic band so before we get started kindly click the subscribe button if you have done that let's get into it So I'll be using this 20 yards of tool and I'll be using this half yard of crepe fabric. This is just for the waistband and I'll also be using this 2 yards of satin fabric for the lining and this elastic band. So like I said, I'll be using 20 yards of tool for the skirt. And for the first layer of the skirt, I'll be using 20 inches by 13 yards. And for the second layer of the skirt, I'll be using 25 inches by 34 yards. So like I said, I'll be using the satin fabric for the lining and the length is 35 inches, but I cut out 37 inches. So I'll be using the two inches to hem the lower part. So the width is two yards. So what I'm going to do is I will use the longest stitch on my sewing machine, starting from one inch. I will sew on half inch all through the two yards and I will gather it up to my waist circumference plus two inches. So my waist circumference is 36 inches plus two, that is 38 inches. So after doing that, I will join the one inch for side seam allowance. So I've done that gathered it up to 38 inches and I stitched on the gathers to keep it in place and I have also hemmed the lower part so I'll keep this aside now for the two I've gone ahead to cut out the first layer of the skirt that is 20 inches by 13 yards so the next thing I'm going to do is I will use the longest stitch on my sewing machine to sew on half inch all through the 13 yards and I will gather it up to 38 inches. Also on the second layer of the skirt, I've gone ahead to cut out the 25 inches by 34 yards so i'll also use the longest stitch on my sewing machine to sew on half inch all through this 34 yards and i'll gather it so for the sake of some of my subscribers that are beginners i had promised i would show you how i gather my tool so i'll do just that so I'm trying to set the sewing machine on the longest stitch. So I'll place the two this way, starting from half inch and using the longest stitch, I'll sew all through the two. So after doing that, I am going to gather the tool and to do that, I'll pick one of the thread and pull it this way. That way I can control the gathers as you can see. So after doing that, I will measure the gathers the length I want and I'll stitch on the gathers to keep it in place so 
so that is that now i have gathered the first layer of the skirt and i ensure it is up to 38 inches and i stitched on the gathers to keep it in place as you can see and i have also gathered the second layer of the skirt that is the 34 yards and this is how it came out so the next thing i'm going to do is to join the lining and the first layer together so i'm going to place it this way that is the good side of the lining and the wrong side of the two so i'll place it this way and align the waist so after doing that i'm going to pin it down and also by half inch so i've done that and i also trimmed the gathers a bit now the next thing i'm going to do is to attach the band and i've gone ahead to cut it out so the elastic is one inch and the band is four and a half inches and i folded half inch on both sides and fold it again so my band height is going to be one and a half inches so i'll place good sides this way the width of the band is also 38 inches so i added half inch on both sides for sewing allowance now i'll stitch on the half inch i've done that as you can see and i'm going to attach the band so I'll place good sides this way and pin down the half inch all through the waist and also on the half inch. After doing that, I'll turn it over and I'll ensure the raw edges are inside and I'll top stitch the other half inch and I'll be sewing from the right side. So I'll leave about one and a half inch space that I'll use to pass my elastic band. So I've done that and this is how it came out. It came out really neat. So this is the one and a half inch that I'll use to pass through my elastic band. So you can place the elastic band on your waist and expand it to know the width to use. Now I'm going to use a safety pin to pass through the elastic band. So after doing that, I'll join the elastic band by half inch and I'll close the one and a half inch space. So I've done that, as you can see, and I've stitched back the one and a half inch. And this is how it came out. Now the next thing I'm going to do is to attach the second layer of the two. So I'm going to place it this way good sides together and I am going to pin it down so for the skirt not to come out too full what I'm going to do is after sewing for about five inches I'll pleat the first layer a bit and sew the gathers so I'll do that all through
so i've done that i sewed by half inch and this is how beautiful it came out so we have come to the end of this tutorials guys kindly give this video a thumbs up and also click on the subscribe button and don't forget to turn on the notification bell to be updated when i upload a new video thank you guys for watching Bye.